In its 72nd year, the Pikes Peak or Best Rodeo continues in the true spirit of good old down-home competition. Absolutely. Craig coffee has been out there all morning. What's going on, Craig? Howdy, guys. A lot going on here at the Norris Penrose Event Center right now. Day number two, like you said, slack competition underway for tonight's big event. And, of course, a lot to happen here. Only one man can take on the challenge to make this all happen. He is your general manager of the Norris Penrose Event Center. This is Mr. Johnny Walker. Good morning. And tell us, what does it take to put this event together? This is a big deal for Southern Colorado. It really is. It's one of the biggest rodeos in the country. So we have a high expectation of how everything's going to go here amongst the contestants and also the fans. So we start working on this several weeks before it actually starts. Uh, once we get going here, it's just around the clock. Our tractors run all night. Uh, we're in the footing business, footing being the, the soil that everybody competes on out here in the arena. So my guys are on it constantly. We're, it has to be the right uh, moisture mix. It has to be the right consistency and it can't slide. It has a lot of things that it has to do and a lot of things it can't do. So, so. there's a lot to think about then. It's not just dumping a bunch of dirt out there and, and go out and have a good time, right? Absolutely not. No, it's actually a science. And uh, there are awards, national awards given out every year for best footing. And this facility has won it four times now. So, and that's for the whole nation. Very nice. Now, we're now that's just inside the arena. There's also, we're talking about all the food, the vendors, right? And, and all that. What does it take to, to coordinate all those events? Well, it's, it's an enormous undertaking, but we're very fortunate along with the uh, people that are on staff here. We also have a big battery of volunteers. So each volunteer kind of has their area of concern and responsibility. Uh, so the vendors will have lots of those. There's one guy that handles all the vendors. He deals with them. He's the go-to guy. Uh, we have an on-site caterer. They handle all the food distribution everywhere. Um, we'll have hundreds and hundreds of horses coming and going every day. So we have barn managers that are facilitating that and making sure that they're getting what they need. Okay, you're also doing a great thing uh, tonight. I know, you know, the Springs uh, really had a, a serious issue the last few weeks here with that fire. Um, tonight, you guys are stepping up in a big way and you're actually giving out free tickets for evacuees. And again, the rodeo is a great time. Good, clean family fun. Tell us more about that. Well, we'd like to offer 100 tickets to the first uh, 100 evacuees that show up. Those are all free. We just want you to come out, um, get out of your hotel rooms, your neighbor's house or wherever you're staying. Just come out, have some fun, enjoy it with us. Um, then also we're going to be offering a big discount, $3 off every ticket to first responders, all of our fire and all the emergency people. Just, you know, thanks for doing such a great job and come out and, and have fun with us tonight. Very nice. Thank you so much, Mr. John. Johnny Walker, there he goes. I love the name, by the way. <laughs> All right, uh, again, rodeo tonight, day two. Come by. It's a good time, fun for the entire family. You can't go wrong. Back to you guys. Thanks so much. It is a good time. Family fun. Love it. Got love it. it. That Western heritage.